What are we doing? What are we doing? Do we need to do the slide puzzle, finally? Should I give it another shot? I didn't even really sit down with this before, um, or attempt it. So we're trying to, like, create some sort of just intelligible message, I suppose, at the very least. We did ask her about the mirror. Let's try to put some sentences together. I'm pretty good at like, I'm good at text twist. I can find, I can find words and letters. Maybe I can find sentences and words. Does that make sense? Water at falls. Water at falls, that makes sense. Water dropping at falls. Strictly speaking, that makes sense. Water dropping. That's the worst part, though, like having to do the slide puzzle on top of it. That said, this is going pretty well. I did! Yes! What? They added a tile for me! I fell ass backwards into it, but we did it! Water unseen at falls mixed with bat dropping yields potion for invisibility. What the hell did that do for me? What did that do? Oh, it, it, the dwarf tile will magically appear. Well, there you go. All right. Awesome. I'm happy. Disc piece, hold up. Something just appeared. <gasps> Illuminate rocks! Oh, I'm so excited. Yes, get in my inventory. And the disc piece, get in there too. Oh, look at that. Oh, that, that's the rocks. There's the disc pieces. Examine the disc pieces. Two broken pieces of something round. Uh, how many pieces do we think there are? Five? I'm trying to like fill this out in my head. Like five or six? Could be a few more. We gotta get going here. We did it! So excited. We'll have to edit that, but still. <laughs> win's a win's a win. Yeah, I don't know about the grammar on that one. It's a fair. It's a fair point. All right. Uh. Cool. I still don't know that we're ready to go into any of these mazes. Like I'll, like maybe pull up some maps for that. You're looking for something? Uh, apparently there's. Just got boats here. Two zorkmids. Two zorkmids for boats, you say? Uh, all right. What do you think of my inventory? I have Zork mids. I rotting meat. Hey, you know that reminds me of this knot called the cow hitch. Hey, it's left and right. Under. I'm gonna get Kurt Russell. Or... <laughs> Like you were reciting yeah. dialogue from Tango and Cash yeah. 6. Ben teaches you the cow hitch. Okay. Thanks, man. I don't... What did I click on for him to teach me Hey, that? you know, that reminds me of this not... Oh, the cow. Right. Cow hitch. Don't show me again, dude. Oh. Yeah, that's fun. Alright, we got a picture of Molly. Excuse me, but I think you are just... A little overripe? I mean, you really smell bad. Yeah, we'll, all right, we'll talk to Ben. Oh, hiya, sailor. Not sure how showing him a picture of a random woman. I had a girl. She's a witch. She's quite a girl. 
Had a fight with her a while back. Uh, I don't even remember what about. I haven't spoken since. I, I wrote her a letter, though. I got it here somewhere. You, you think maybe you could do me a favor and, and take it to her? Appreciate it. Good for you, man. Which, uh, Ida, she's, uh, she's all right. All right. Yeah, that's, uh, we're beyond Pu uh, Pluto logic at this point. That's how I feel, but that's fine. We're figuring it out. Ooh, get out of here. Forgot about that. I only use fresh ingredients in my potion. Is this meat gonna come in handy? We thought we'd gotten rid of the bad magic. We already talked about Cows this, Grandpa. Fatter, Maybe not in this universe, down, but... Food got better, life was good. Yeah, I'm not gonna open the, the letter. Over the years, the evil magic began to seep down into the soil, and eventually it settled in the Illuminite. Magic and Illuminite seemed to attract. I remember a witch who had that effect on me. <laughs> Here. Yeah, I just I didn't want to leave fresh it. Ingredients I, in my potion. Yeah, I didn't want to leave it on the top. All right, bad meat. Drop the meat. Yeah, I'll just save over this. That's fine. Go on inside. All right, we still need to show her the the uh, the book. Hmm. Is that not, not the right book? Oh, I gotta talk to her, don't I? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the that's that's how we do stuff in this game. Oh, let me see. Oh, it's in Zorkman's script. Do you know why most Zork jokes are one line? So flatheads can remember them. <laughs> Ben's a lucky man. What can I say? All right, let's show her the, uh... Oh, wait. Is she gonna, like... Oh, hello! The potion's not ready yet. But you could have a cup of tea. Frogs have to boil down just a bit. I use too much water. <laughs> a little shy, huh? You just sit there and sip your tea until you feel better. All right, well, let's give her the letter. Where is the letter? Sealed letter. Do I need to open the letter for- I don't... There you go. Oh, for me? I must take your boat. Wait, what? Why don't you take that stick so you can navigate the bogs? Thank you. You're such a dear. No, it's this is how we get out of here. You have permission to take the witch's stick. I guess we get the bat too, right? <laughs> how did I get it last time? She gave me permission last time. I guess she looked at something else in my way. Is that me? We seem to be working at cross purposes. I must relieve you of your belongings until you learn. What? What the hell is going on? Someone has to say it, right? <laughs> yeah, we had to ask her about something. Oh, the, oh, the you've rock. got some aluminite? You know, the dwarfs found a huge piece of it. They used to call that Phoebo's Folly. That was before they found a use for the stuff. Poor Phoebo. He wasn't so that appreciated guy was going to take lifetime. all my stuff if had I kept playing and mine just shaft scattered it mind. everywhere? Couldn't tell his left from his right. <laughs> this game is so mean. Good lord. The mirror. Oh. My grandpa. You've got one of Rupert's orbs. 
He built it with Wizard Trimbile and Moodock. Connect with the battery. Canuck must be about 425 years old by now. Can I have a bat? And the wizard? He's got to be a lot older than that. They cast themselves a long life spell before the Great Diffusion. 400 years ago, all the wizards got together to dispel the evil magic from the Great Underground Empire. Everything with magical powers was either destroyed or dismantled. That lot of good, that did. Oh, let me see. Oh, it's in Zorkmid's script. Do you know why most Zork jokes are one line? So Flatheads can remember them. <laughs> oh, you got some illuminate? You know, the dwarfs found a huge piece of it. They used to call that Phoebo's Folly. That was before they found a use for the stuff. Poor Phoebo. He... wasn't appreciated in his lifetime. Flew out an open mine shaft after a drinking binge. Couldn't tell his left from his right. Alright. Was it the milk? Aww. Have you ever tried to milk a cow with cold hands? These little darlings are very useful, and so are their byproducts. Oh, the bats. We have permission to take the bats. Should we take the bats? Oh, for me? I must take your boat. Why don't you take that stick so you can navigate the bogs? Thank you. You're such a dear. Okay. Should I take the bats? I guess we're taking the bats. She said I could do it. I don't know. We got the stick. For whatever that's worth. Is that... Is that good? <laughs> the white noise jump scares. <laughs> you can't walk on water. All right, I don't know what I, what did I get from that? Throw bat cage at stick. Yeah, kinda. Uh. Okay, if it sinks, don't go that way. Well, that's back to her. Alright, so we're going this way. So it could just be a lot of trial and error if you didn't have the stick. A lot of saving. Restoring. Bloop, bloop. But I came from the... So, so we walked to a dead end. That's kind of annoying. I don't remember if I came from that way. Is he 
now I don't remember which way I came from like three moves ago, so I'm like, am I walking back to her hut now? I don't know. I don't remember going west or east this many times in the same direction. Oh, thank goodness. Because I had not been saving. Just wouldn't let me put my stick down. Oh my god. Yeah, that guy was playing the long game. Alright, we're out. We're out. Dinosaur story. I know that doesn't track, but still. Thank god. Alright, um... Let's go back in the swamp. Oh, we're in the woods. We're in the woods now. All right. Uh, woods. Mm. I can't think of anything I'd rather do after leaving the swamp than do more mazes. But in a forest this time? What did it say about my peripheral? Tunnel vision? Oh, that's not good. You really gotta know where you're going here, huh? Oh, I got out. <laughs> Alright. That's fair. Uh, Yeah, this needs to be a Video Games 101. Outside of the... Reality that we'd have to play it again. Oh. Yes! What is that? Oh, I hear a voice! If that's part of the soundtrack, that'll make me sad. Turns. Release the bats! Help me, bats! And the and the, and the milk. Magic. Should I've done that in a different order. Maybe I should have done that first, actually. Hold on. Let's do that first. While we still have uh, a bit more of our eyesight. Alright, hold on. Turn. Let's drink the milk. You can see a little clear. Thank you, Bat Guano. Clutch. We're going east. We're going south. Going east. Going south. That's forward. Three rings return! That, that, that's what she's saying. My eyes have failed. Alright, I waited a little bit too long on the milk. Just the way the grooves like it. The grooves like 
wait until my eyesight goes out, and they're like, pounce! <laughs> yeah, the out of context chat is pretty nutty. You drank the milk too late, you drank it too soon. How about that? <laughs> Even with context, it's weird. do with all these bats. This maze is going a little too... Alright, there you go. These mazes go on a little too... Okay. Where are we? Ferryman's dock. I'm gonna use my dagger on the bell again. I gotta... in here? The ferryman's dock? Where is the ferryman? Is he meant to show up at some point? I'm a customer! Come on, there you go. token here. Show it. Nice. charge here? Alright. <laughs> yeah, those jump scares. Okay. Ferryman's Isle. Uh-oh. We're near Canuck's house. I've known Canuck a very long time, so I'll see you later. It's not like you've been interacting with anyone here. This looks like uh, we're in uh, Black Cauldron a little bit. It's like where we took Henwin. Henwin. Sweet boy. Or girl. All right. It's right in front of you and can open very large doors. Can I put it in my pants? Yeah. Hello? I suspect you're who I'm meant to talk to here, just cause... Quack, quack. Just some guy half-assing it. Uh, we need a duck, we don't have the foley for it. Hey, Gene, come over here. Ugh. It's like, come on, man. I went to grad school, just, just say quack, quack. The duck is talking. Quack, quack. Is it? Quack, quack. <laughs> quack, quack. Man, what was the original like? They must have been so bummed when they couldn't put all this ridiculousness into the original 1970s, Zork. Can I take this? 
Quack, mm. quack. For you to stop me, duck. And take these blueprints. Blueprints of one of Canuck's inventions. Just looks like a magnet shield. Scroll. Read it and drop it. And as per spell, the subject is enchanted. Failure to discern so has resulted in unprecedented increase of bird brains within the greater underground empire. Q Canuck, one of Canuck's favorite spells. All right, so we're not going to take that. Quack quack. Yes, quack quack. Quack quack. Out of grab that uh, that bottle. Quack quack. What's in the bottle? Can I open the bottle? Quack quack. Ship in a bottle. Well, I guess we'll leave it there. Quack quack. Quack quack. Maybe this will help. <gasps> Canuck! Thank you. You unducked, Canuck? I've been waiting a long time for that. I was getting tired of eating bugs and fish. I found some really juicy grubs down by the rushes. Looks like Jeff Goldblum from back here. Just drop the scroll, I guess, right? Hello. <sighs> Thank you. I've been waiting a long time for that. Suspicious. Getting tired of well, man, just turned fish. from a duck to it. I found some really juicy grubs down by the rushes. Okay, let's see. You know, let's show him our inventory here. He's too spellbound to reply. Why don't you take that to the Cliffs of Depression? They might know what it is. Why'd they get that other guy to read that part? Oh, the bonding plan. Okay. Yeah, that club, the comedy club. Yeah, we. I don't. I'm not threatening this dude. Oh, I like books. Oh, oh, this part is written in Mythicin, my old language. Kirkland version of Chekhov. Here's Goblin. a good one. How many Union dwarfs does it take to dig up a piece of aluminite? Fifteen. You got a problem with that? Ah! <laughs> you got a problem with that? You don't get it. No. <sighs> But I appreciate that you're not explaining it to me. Hey, I built that. I built that with some friends of mine. Mudok, Trimbile, and Rupert. Rupert. Rupert turned me into a duck. Why'd he turn me into a duck? That's a good question. That's Illuminate. Pardon. Pardon me. That's part of the last remaining flying disc of Froboss. The Froboss Magic Company made them four or five hundred years ago. They were used to shatter walls of illusion. The wizard said they would hide all the magic in the world behind one. But that disc is broken into pieces and hidden. I now live behind a wall of illusion. <laughs> They're a lot of fun. We used to wreck walls of illusion and throw those discs at them just to see them crumble. He's going into James Earl Jones every now and then. Oh, you have a pet vulture. They're all mine. Mine! Every mindless one of them! <laughs> Is that the guy that's been laughing every time I die? Okay. I guess that's everything. Why don't you take that to the Cliffs of Depression? They might know what it is. Mrs. Mudok. I don't know why, but she's never nice to me. Oh, that's... Cow! That's Mrs. Mudok? I didn't know that. Thanks. <laughs> okay. Thanks. I know there's a piece of the disc in that bottle. Oh. I put it there myself. Okay. I can't get it, I'm too old. But 
I can shrink you so you can go inside and get it. You're like young yes. Jeff Goldblum. Go ahead. Spell will only last 20 minutes. I didn't agree. Okay. Guess we're doing this. Twenty minutes. Twenty minutes. <laughs> Twenty minutes. In the next episode, we will grab the third piece of that disc and uh, talk more with Bargain Ben Jeff Goldblum, I suppose, as we continue this Return to Zorik playthrough right here on Let's Play with Brigands. See if more confusing times end that one. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to like and comment on this video, and click subscribe if you haven't already, as this seriously helps me to keep making great content for you.